from your hyperlocal weather source. This is your Norcast weather update. Brought to you by the ACUA, keeping Atlanta County clean and green for a better future. Now offering facility visits in Atlantic City every Wednesday at 12 p.m. More details at acua.com. Hey everybody, thanks so much for checking us out on the Norcast Weather Channel. Not a great afternoon, especially with areas of rain coming in. Definitely need the umbrellas handy. Look how cool those temperatures are right now. Liberty Bell City coming in at 52, 47 in State College, 49 in Scranton. Obviously with the rain, it kind of feels like a November afternoon out there. Rain's just going to continue to pick up in intensity, and by tonight I think we're looking at areas of very heavy rainfall. Temperatures consistent in the lower 50s will continue this overnight, even some 40s popping up. Just raw, windy, rainy. By tomorrow morning, we're looking at the uh, prospect of tidal flooding coming our way. So the good news is once the system's out of here, yeah, it's going to rain all night. It's going to rain into tomorrow morning. But I think we actually try to break for some sunshine tomorrow afternoon. So we're going to hope for that. Then Monday is okay. Clouds linger. We have a system offshore. Tuesday could bring us a couple spotty showers, but aside from that, the pattern going forward is not that bad. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday are looking good before yet another system comes our way just in time for the weekend. I know, I know you don't really want to hear that, but it is what it is. It's a pattern recognition. We see this kind of stuff happen every seven days at this point. So rainfall totals, not changing my ideas on this. One to two inches, heaviest along the coastline, then more for obviously the end of the week. For tonight, 46, cloudy skies, areas of wind. At the beaches especially, those gusts could exceed 30 or 35 miles an hour. That's going to be pushing excess water ashore. 8 to 11 o'clock tomorrow morning, a lot of the barrier islands probably dealing with about a half a foot of water in the streets. So move your cars to higher ground before you go to bed tonight. For tomorrow, 60 degrees, mostly cloudy skies. But later on in the afternoon, there is a scenario I see where we'll try to brighten things up just a little bit. Spotty shower can't be ruled out on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday looking decent before we pull in yet another chance of wet weather for the weekend. Overall, temperatures not bad, trending into the upper 60s by midweek. Have yourselves a wonderful afternoon.